Lion on set. Lion looks good. Away. Master Rady begins quickly, straight out to the early lead. Parpalet from the inside bounced on terms with Blue Odyssey and Bells Banner pushing forward. And it's going to be up outside the leader, although Blue Odyssey is going to be right there too. Sebra Kate, the one who gets out of the speed battle. So Master Rady, the track specialist here, shows the way a half in front, although saying that most of these are. Out a little bit deep, Bells Banner's around the outside of Blue Odyssey as they run off the back of the course. Tracking up, Parpalet gets a nice run in transit off the back and two lengths away, Sebra Kate. So at the 500, metre mark and Master Rady for Vanessa Rahn it shows out a length in front, Parpalette's dying for a run, gets off the rail now, pushes its way into the clear and that post now, Blue Odyssey out three wide, Bells Banner fourth drops off and Sebra Kate railing home quite nicely, they straighten inside the 250 now and Master Rady the leader going for it for the judge now but look at Sebra Kate, comes off its back, Parpalette just been left flat footed and deeper out Blue Odyssey, the leader Master Rady, Sebra Kate just can't get to the margin yet, it's Master Rady in front close to home, Sebra Kate's going to dive late but Master Rady he's a dead set specialist here at the bay and Master Rady wins it ahead on the line to Sebra Kate Gallant third will go to Blue Odyssey a gap then in the field to Parpalette and Bells Banner the last one home Master Rady number one Vanessa Arnott Nicole Irwin holding off the challenges here began beautifully from a wide gate first up since December wide gate saying it was the uh, five of five crossed him Rolled along, had the Clark trio in a bit of trouble, although Papa let, looked like it was going to just put itself into the pitch as Shires was trying to get off the fence down the side. He did so, but as soon as he did that, he flattened out, and then Sebra Kate got right up on the inside, and it looked a challenger there for Sire and Fork down inside the 150, but in the end, Master Rady has really just responded under the urging because of Vanessa Runner, and we'll get the money here. Sebra Kate second, 103.74 time. Going into the uh, border, long head, the winning margin. The numbers here, one, two, three. Um, could be four, five, two. Long head by three and a quarter. We'll just get that confirmed, of course. 103, seven, four. Yep, one, two, three, four. And fifth goes to five, Bells Banner. So Master Rady is an eight-year-old bay gilding, Master of Design Lady of DeMello, owned by Nicole, well, owned by Mrs. D.P. Stevenson, long-time owner of Nicole's. And Nicole Irwin trains, of course, Darwin Cup winning trainer from last year with Highly Decorated who looks like it'll make its return here to the top end in the next couple of weeks Weeks Highly Decorated. Apparently last reports all was on track so we'll see the cup winner not too far away and ridden by Vanessa Arnott. Now a long head by three and a quarter the margin. Second to two Sebra Kata, five-year-old chestnut gelding uh, by Sebring Karkaka Katie for David Bates, Adam Nichols. And third to three, Blue Odyssey, a five-year-old Bale Brown gilding charge forward, Glade, Gary Clark, Jared Todd. Fourth went to four, Parplet, as I said, looked pretty promising coming around the turn. And fifth went to five, Bells Banner, which just caught a little bit wide in the run. But the winner returns, folks, it starts 63-13, wins 17 minor placings. Has got an exceptional record here at the Bay, Master Rady. That's its uh, tenth start now for six wins, two seconds, two thirds. And that win this afternoon will take its prize money up towards the $300,000 mark. Well done. Correct weight. We wait for.